The antennas I got from Amazon on the left is the gold one. The one on the right is the one I received from Tiny Whoop. That's the one that's plastic coated and should be more resilient to crashes. First step to installation, of course, is removing the old one. I heated up the, uh, the base or where the shielding is, the solder there. Used a solder sucker to remove the solder off of that. And then I used my soldering iron again to remove the second lead going to my VTX. Pull off the old antenna, threw it aside. Here's a close up of our two connections. Fortunately, the focus is pretty bad. Here's the circular polarizer I'm going to put in its place. Um, I did need to modify it slightly. I just wanted to bend the end a little bit just so that the contacts are um, touching the VTX uh, solder point directly. I wanted to bend those now so I don't have to bend them later. Um, just place it against it to make sure it works. And then I'm just doing the reverse now. I'm going to solder first the end to the VTX. Um, that's the harder of the two. It's also the smaller pad of the two. And then once I've confirmed that that is soldered and held into place securely, I'm going to go back with my soldering iron and I'm going to go back to the shielding and I'm going to solder that as well. Um, that was a little trickier. I had to get both sides. Um, also wanted to be careful not to use too much solder. Uh, if I did, then I could potentially make a connection between two points of the antenna and of course that would render it useless. Um, once I was confident that I had both of those ends done, um, just did a visual inspection and um, you know, plugged it in, make sure that it worked. Here's how it all looks. So this is that Amazon antenna on a Tiny Whoop FX 805 OSD camera. I am in a two-story house, now harassing my cat Dexter, who's on the main floor with me. I'm going to fly downstairs into the basement to give you an idea of what type of reception I can get from a floor away. Um, pretty good. Uh, get a little bit of static that may be as a result of my furnace being in the middle. I notice that once I go past right around here, I get a little bit of flashing. Um, once I get beyond that, I get pretty good reception. Back of the house as well, uh, a couple rooms away. It all looks good. Hit me up if you've got any questions on the installation. More than happy to help.